I think there should be an urban plan to revitalize America, urban America. There should be that kind of, of plan. We have invested hundreds of millions of dollars in the inner city of, of Buffalo, and still that is not enough. I don't think there are enough resources in the community at the local level for the kind of revitalization uh, that will be most meaningful. As I look at Jefferson Avenue, and I'm sitting on Jefferson Avenue now across from the tops, we brought the supermarket here when I was a city council member, when other corporations uh, refused to invest in the, uh, in the inner city of Buffalo. Uh, many food deserts where uh, people in the black community live. Top supermarket finally agreed to, to come in. Uh, and this has been one of the most successful supermarkets in that chain. Uh, recently, we worked to bring a Northwest Bank to the community. There's an M&T Bank down the street. Uh, in the other direction, uh, we've built new affordable housing further down down the street. Uh, we have brought a financial wellness center to Jefferson Avenue. And even with those investments and more, there still is so much more that has to be done. So we do need an urban plan. And that plan has to provide more federal and state dollars to urban areas and to the money that cities can provide. Fortunately, through the American Rescue Plan Act uh, that President Biden was able to push through, there will be hundreds of millions of dollars coming to the city of Buffalo. And much of it will be directed to the urban community in the city of Buffalo. The new governor of the state of New York, Kathy Hope Hochul, has committed hundreds of millions of dollars uh, to uh, the urban areas in Buffalo. That is a great start, but we need a comprehensive plan for Buffalo and its urban community and urban areas all across the country.